Salut, allo, bonjour tout le monde. Welcome to the May We podcast from the Alliance Française de Chicago. My name is Jane. I am the Marketing, Communications, and Library intern here at the Alliance Française. And today we are going to kick off the grammar series with Elodie Kaplan. Enjoy. So I'm here with Elodie Kaplan. She is yeah. the director of our Learning Center. Hi. And she's here to talk to us about pronunciation. Yes, I'll try to do that. So when people think about pronunciation, first of all, pronunciation in French, they get very afraid. But there is no reason to be afraid. We'll, we'll work on that together. So what are we working on today? What's, what's on the list? Today, first, let's talk about intonation and a couple of basic vowels so you can start pronouncing like a pro. All right, like a pro. All yeah. right, let's get started. Okay, so first, <laughs> intonation. I'm basing uh, my comparison between French and English. English from here, because this is what I'm exposed to. But I see that intonation in French and English is completely different. Uh, for example, how do you say the place, the city we're living in? Chicago. Ooh, Chicago. I, <laughs> I you know, I hear a little mountain here, like Chicago. Mm -hmm. So that is not happening in French, ever. You cannot never, put never, intonation never. in the middle or beginning of a word like that unless you're upset with someone or something is completely wrong. But normal case scenario, the intonation is at the end. Chicago, 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 Chicago. New York, Los Angeles, Miami, San Francisco. Okay. okay. Ah, non, Instead of San Francisco, San Francisco. San Francisco, going up okay. every time, going up. You you cannot do the little mountain Chicago thing in the middle. It doesn't work. No mountains in France. Nope, okay. no mountains. No, and we have some, but not in our language. Not in our language. So uh, that's the first thing, intonation. The second thing, maybe? Yeah, let's, let's keep going. Yeah, so the second thing is vowels. They're very difficult for French speakers that try to speak English is so <laughs> difficult because we don't understand why. For example, let's take the vowel A, the A in English is pronounced A in French. If we pronounce the name Barbara, Barbara, you have three A's that are not pronounced Barbara. the same way. <laughs> and I don't get that. It's very hard. Um, I don't get that because I'm French and because in France we pronounce A. Guess how we pronounce it all the time? Ah, you got it. <laughs> it's so always it's the same. Okay. Barbara. Okay. Barbara. So a vowel, I take a vowel by itself, not combined with any other. That's for another day, but by itself, ah. So Barbara. Is it like that with all the vowels? Well, let's take a e. Actually, it's an i that we pronounce e. E. Uh, come wifi. Oh yeah, that's Wi-Fi. Wifi. Okay. So if you take that and you know that the e I is always pronounced E, then you can pronounce Diana. Diana. Yeah. Diana. Diana. Okay. You have an A, you have an E, you make Diana. Diana. Here you go. And with that, you can pronounce a lot of the, what I call the transparent words that are just written the same in English and in French, but you can get a little bit adventurous and try to pronounce them the French way with the right intonation and the right vowels. Well, sweet. All right. Thanks so much. You're welcome. <laughs>